We're here with the letter G for the A to Z Alphabet Junk Journal Challenge here on the Dear Julie Julie channel. Letter G. Golden Guest Check with Garland, Gauze, and Game Pace. Stay tuned for details. Hi everybody, it's Julie. I'm here with the letter G for our A to Z Alphabet Junk Journal Challenge here on the Dear Julie Julie channel. And it is Golden Guest Check with Garland, Gauze, and Game Piece. Use something gold to embellish your guest check, add a garland, and a game piece, and some gauze. Okay, so here we go. We have our guest check. I have two of them. And we're going to go ahead and add our something gold and our theme is pansies this is our game piece it's a flinch card okay have to have a garland. There we go. Okay, so here we go with our first one. We'll go ahead and use our glue stick. I'm going to Put glue onto the gold doily and have enough that I can um, have it go over, fold over so that it looks nicer on the front here. So here's our gold love these gold doilies. They are from the bakery section at Michael's where they have like the little um, well, like the cake uh, cardboards and things like that. Okay, so there is our gold. And next we need to have a garland and I think I'm going to go ahead and glue down this variety of items and this will be our game piece so we'll just go ahead and glue them down in a garland format okay so these are some pieces from the these are from the vibrant Pansy uh, digital kit. The daisy is from some copy paper from Dollar Tree. Okay, and this pansy is from the vibrant. Okay, and the flinch card is from the flinch card digital kit in the Dear Julie Julie Etsy shop and the digitals are all still 50% off and that is while we're home so if you find yourself in need of some digitals they are there and ready 24 7 so we have been using this gold bling throughout the journal so I'm going to use this as my banner string, starting at the edge, coming across, coming across, and so this bling has sticky on it. It is also from, it is from Michaels, and I think there 
here at dollar fifty now. So there's my little banner going across. We'll go ahead and cut this off just so that we don't end up with a mess there. So the other thing that we have going on is we have the guest receipt. I usually take them apart. And so I'm going to turn this into a pocket. Okay. And the other thing we have to add is a is gauze. And so for this one, I'm just going to add I have I'm I counted tool as a gauze cuz it's a gauze like item and then cheesecloth. Cheesecloth is also gauze like. So that's what I was thinking of was cheesecloth when I did this. So a gauze fabric. I'm going to go ahead and um, ruffle it together, fold it together, and I'm going to add it to the top and that will give me a little gauze tab on the top. So, something gold, guest check, add a garland, a game piece, and some gauze. So there's one. Okay, and the other thing I had to add here was a Trivial Pursuit card, and I can't find it now. So I wanted to put that in the pocket here. So when I find it, that will be a second um, game piece. Okay. So there is our first guest check. We need to make a second one. So here is our second one. This time I'm going to put my pocket on the back. And we'll start with that just so I don't lose it or forget it. Okay. And I, like I said, I usually always take them off. And okay, so we're going to start with our gauze this time. I'm going to cut a strip. Again, I'm using cheesecloth. This was cheesecloth from my mom's stash. You can coffee dye cheesecloth. Um, and I have avocado dyed cheesecloth in the other room. And it it does really, it takes the color really, really well. So I'm going to go ahead and let that start going. We're going to add this to the edge of this one. And, okay, so our gauze is going to be on the edge of this So we need some gold. So I have this piece of gold and I have, just because we want to make sure that, or I want to make sure that I'm using, you know, some of the items that are similar to what we've been using. So I'm going to go ahead and cut this or rip this. Okay, so it's ripped, it's ripped, that'll give us edges for our garland, and um, there we go. Now this garland I am going to use some of the baker's twine I have up here, and it's a mess, but there we go, okay. So I'm going to go through these pieces here and up and then they'll hang off. Okay, so we have a lot going on on this one. Let's go ahead and get this, get this started. Okay, looks like we're just, yep, there we go. Okay, so we're going to put some of the gauze down this side here. And I'm going to put the edge that
that was the edge of the gauze um, because it's a finished edge on the outside. Okay. And I need like three hands for this because my finger is going to get caught up in it. Here, I'll just go like this. So I'm putting it on and I'm ruffling it up. I love the look of ruffled gauze. I have beautiful peach and green that my mom had in her fabric stuff that I've that you've seen me use. I haven't used it in a while. Um, but it's very, very cool. These are my anti-sticky scissors. Okay. They resist, they resist the sticky. So there is our little gauze edge. And wouldn't that be beautiful? Coffee dyed. I did not coffee dye it because I haven't coffee dyed anything else in this, um, this journal. It's been, um, it's been white. We're doing enough coffee dyeing in the beginner's junk journal. Okay. And if I have, um, I've, I've forgotten that I did. Okay. So we'll go put this one. I want it just, I love the numbers on a guest, guest check. So I want those to show. And... Then, okay, so what I'm going to do here is I'm actually going to sew on the card. Okay, I'm going to go through and I'm going to leave that piece hanging down. Okay, and then I'm going to come back up and go over. Okay, like it was a like it was a garland or a banner. Okay. And come back up. It doesn't Thing was driving me crazy stuck on my finger okay right, let's try there nope that's right back in where we came out okay I'll tell you what I'm gonna do I'll come up through the card well that didn't work did it Now, I'm gonna, I want to grab a hold of this. Let's see, we're right here. So I'm gonna come up through it, go back down. Okay. I'm just gonna go ahead and sew this on, but I want it to, I want you to see the the thread um, I'm gonna go all the way over to the inside of the Stacy here okay then I'm gonna come to the inside of this one to the outside inside of that Back up through the center. This would have been really great if I'd have used like purple or blue, but that's okay. We're okay, and then we're gonna go from here into the center of this one. Come up. 
come up just outside of this. So this is just giving you an idea of another way to add a garland. And um, the other thing about it is that um, hand stitching on in a journal is ama amazing. Don't stick your finger out. And then one more. We're going to come out with this one. Okay. So there we have our little banner. So we have our gold, our gauze, our garland. Okay. And so then we need a game piece. And we have these bingo pieces and that might be kind of cool like right there in the middle of that I think that's a great way to do that and then we'll go ahead and one two three four one two three and oh cool look at there oh we're getting to the end we might as well use this up okay now, if this was last month, there would have been a, a prize because I, or no, to February. Finish it February we had. Okay, so let's go ahead and grab our double-sided tape. Cut a piece off. Twist it around. Okay, twisting it around. We're going to tighten it, hold it or clamp them together, pull one side so we have our little and we're going to add, we're going to go ahead and you can fluff it. So fluff, fluff it. We're going to lay it down in the center of this daisy and we are going to add our bingo. And so that's our game piece this time. Now on the back of this one, we have a pocket that we'll be able to add um, something to. If you have another game piece, go ahead and add a game piece or a project life card or a journaling card, um, something. But that gives us two guest checks. Now the other thing on this guest check, I'm going to go ahead and... I'm going to round the, the corners. I just think that this will make it look a little more finished. Now we might be getting full. Yep, that's what's happening. So, anyway, so that is our guest checks I think we I don't know I think we'll leave this one and just we'll just round the tops of this one okay so there are the guest checks that we have that we can add into this um, into this journal that we're making for the A to Z junk journal challenge we have our golden guest check with garland, gauze, and game piece. Use something gold to embellish your guest check. Add a garland and a game piece and some gauze. There you go. So I hope you enjoyed that. Um, if you are interested in joining the A to Z Junk Journal Challenge, the... Um, Details videos in the description box down below, as well as the playlist for the letters that we have done so far. And I hope you're enjoying it. And also, I look forward to seeing you all this week, Monday through Thursday at 3.35 Pacific Standard Time for our live Beginner's Junk Journal series. 
doing all different kinds of things and then possibly one day this week at 10.35 Pacific, Pacific Standard Time for coffee dyeing and like um, Easter egg dyeing of paper. So um, don't forget that the digital kits are on sale in the Etsy shop, the Dear Julie Julie Etsy shop for 50% off and have an amazing day. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Bye-bye.